love the flavor of Indian spices? Well, I've got a beautiful recipe for you today that's vegan and bursting with flavor. Stay tuned. Hi, my name is Katrina. Welcome to the Organics Channel, where we bring health into the kitchen one recipe at a time. Today, we're going to be making a nourishing vegan cauliflower masala. I know today's recipe has a lot of ingredients and I hope it doesn't scare you away. And I will be sure to let you know at the end whether it was worth it. So in your frying pan, skillet, or my cast iron pan, add two tablespoons of olive oil. Heat up your oil over medium heat. Add in one shallot or one small yellow onion that's been chopped. I'm going to use a shallot, which is a type of onion that has really strong anti-cancer properties. One tablespoon of freshly grated ginger root that is excellent for your digestion. Two tablespoons of freshly grated turmeric root, which is a natural anti-inflammatory. So beautiful in color. Four chopped garlic cloves that can help strengthen your immune system and help fight off colds. Cook for about four minutes or until your onion has turned translucent and soft, making sure that you stir frequently. Next, add in your spices, which consists of cumin, curry, chili, cayenne pepper, and some Himalayan salt. This is gonna give some lovely spice to our dish. Two diced tomatoes, and did you know that just one tomato can provide up to 40% of your daily intake of vitamin C? Lovely. Stir and cook for about two more minutes to bring out these flavors of the spices. Add in your cauliflower florets, which are wonderful for your digestion and can help reduce inflammation. Two cups of your favorite veggies chopped. I'm going to use carrots, which are excellent for your eye health. And we'll add a beautiful orange color. Last one cup of vegetable broth. Bring everything to a boil and then you're going to re want to reduce it down to a simmer for about 20 minutes or until your cauliflower gets soft. Mm, this is smelling so good. Okay, so now that this is finished cooking, take one half cup of full fat coconut milk and you're going to want to whisk in either two, one to two drops of lemon essential oil or just one tablespoon of fresh lemon juice. Whichever is easiest, whichever you have on hand. One, whoop, got an extra one in there. Whisk it together and then add to your pan and we're going to want to cook this for about three more minutes just until everything is heated up and ready to serve. Mm, our cauliflower masala is ready to be dished up. So you can serve it over top of rice, which is what I'm going to do, or you could serve it over some mixed greens, or you could just even have it all on your own. It looks so good. It smells even better. I cannot wait to taste this one. Look at that beautiful color. Okay, let's give this vegan masala a taste. I don't know if you can hear it, but my food is still cooking over here, simmering a little bit. Sounds good, smells amazing. That is so good. All the spices really blend together really well. I love that little bit of lemon that we added at the end, how that gave it just a little bit of a more fresh taste, I would say. It is really delicious. I think it's worth your time, um, but you would have to be the judge for that and try it for yourself. So definitely give it a try and let us know how it goes for you. Join me each week in the kitchen for a new recipe to stay inspired and be reminded that healthy eating can be flavorful and worth every minute of your time. I will see you next week in the kitchen.